So yes, we are going to name Hua Tao and Gong An, Gong An and Hua Tao. So before we explain Hua Tao, we need to know what Gong An is, or in Japanese, we call it Ko An, right? What Gong An is, right? Actually, Gong An or Ko An are Zen teachings or dialogues or stories which are used to practice Zen meditation. We use some Zen stories, some dialogues between the Zen master and the, his disciple or his guest to investigate Zen, right? So this is the Gong An, this is the definition of Gong An. But originally Gong An, right? Before it, it was called Gong An, right? It's a private teaching or dialogue of story between a Zen master and his or her disciples or guest. Because that teachings or that dialogue, that story is so weird or outstanding or powerful, it can confuse practitioners profoundly. The practitioners to advance their meditative level or even push practitioners to enlightenment right at the moment when the teaching is given. Yeah, that teaching is so weird, outstanding and powerful. It can confuse the practitioners profoundly, lead them to advance their meditative level, or even push them to enlightenment right at the moment. So for this reason, that teaching, that dialogue story, is spread through the Zen community. Other Zen masters even use the same teaching to guide their disciples. So this makes the original private teaching become public teaching materials or public cases shared by the entire community from generation to generation. Yeah. So this is a definition of Gong An. Actually, it's just a, a teaching between original, uh, between one Zen master and his or her students, right? And that teaching is so brilliant, so outstanding. And when we say it's so brilliant, so outstanding, it's only because of that teaching confuse people, confuse his students, the practitioner, so profoundly. Yeah. And that kind of teaching is so valuable. Right? So that kind of teaching has been carried on in Zen community from generation to generation. So this is a koan, gong an or Zen stories, right? And then what is a hua tao then? So now we know gong an, right? Gong an means Zen stories, right? And then what is, what is hua tao then, right? Hua tao actually is some critical phrase, phrase or question that is used to practice Zen meditation. You can just take it as a doubting question, right? When we are practicing doubting meditation. But Hua Tao actually is cited from Gong An, from those outstanding, brilliant stories, right? And Hua Tao means the critical phrases, critical dialogues or questions cited from Gong An, right? Yeah. Um, but, uh, but most, in most cases, right, they are cited from Gong An, and we just work on it, we we'll just work on it. But sometimes Zen masters will give a doubting question or a phrase to their disciples to meet, it, to meet it that with, to investigate them. That phrase, that question that give, given by your master is called your hua tao, your doubting question as well. Okay, good. So now you know what Gong An is, what Zen story is, and what Hua Tao is, what doubting question is, right? For example, here in our uh, Zen center, we use what is no self as our doubting question, as our Gong An, right? Good.